Once the dispenser has been taken out of service, remove the nozzle and allow the hose to drain completely. Loosen the connection between the short whip hose and the safety brake and unscrew the connection. Loosen the remaining safety brake connection and discard the old unit. Install the new safety brake on the long hose. Be sure to install the safety brake in the proper direction by referencing the flow arrow marked on the outside of the unit. Tighten the connection securely, but do not over tighten. Install the safety brake onto the short whip hose and tighten the connection securely, but do not over tighten. Finally, reinstall the nozzle. Place the fueling point back into service per your company procedure and test the nozzle function before opening the fueling point for customer use. Be sure to inspect all connections for leaks as part of this testing.